asking yourself, Casey, you're such a together person. How could you let this happen? The story is a sad but true one, and maybe you can relate. It all started once upon a time with a dream about compost. My little brain was learning how much calcium carbonate this sweet little egg could add to the soil to make my tomatoes and my peppers and all my other plants in the garden super happy. I started composting. I'd stir my compost with my happy little heart and I'd sift out all the good stuff. But you know what was always left behind? Yeah. Yeah. Now ask yourself, what good is this eggshell doing to a plant like this? Not. Not. Not sure is it? So, I did what any reasonable person would do, and I decided to come up with a solution. Mm -hmm. Enter my food processor. Yeah, take one of these little babies, stick it right in there, to your heart's content. And now, all of a sudden, when you toss it on your compost pile, or you dump it in while you're planting your tomatoes and your peppers, all of a sudden, all this calcium carbonate is just there. It's just there. So I knew I had made the right decision. I dutifully started powdering up my eggshells as soon as I had a batch of 12. And I, I kept it up and, and, and the system, it was working. And I, and I had just jars ready to go of powdered eggshell and it was amazing. Until this year, I just got so busy in the garden that I got a bit behind in my eggshell powdering. So today, ha <laughs> ha, we are getting caught up. I am gonna be powdering up all of my eggshells and putting it all into jars. And let's, uh, go ahead, I want you to guess right now how long you think it's gonna take for us to go through the whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you what I'm doing when I'm doing it, but this is really pretty easy and self-explanatory. Let's go. Alrighty, first things first. What do we got? What supplies do we need? Uh, I have a random assortment of different size jars and lids. I have my food processor. I have the little bitty mini chopper attachment on. And I got my eggs, and that is it. Now, just to kind of get the basics out of the way, if you were to take this eggshell, shove it in your compost bin, uh, and next year you stir the compost and you sift out all the good stuff, you're still gonna see this eggshell. It's highly likely you're still gonna see this eggshell. Calcium carbonate, that's, it's really hard. <laughs> it's a really hard substance. It takes a lot to break it down. And when you leave it in your soil in big pieces like this, um, you're not leaving much surface area to, for the soil to really get in there and help it break down. Even if you crumble it up like that, those are some still really large, huge pieces. It's gonna take you a while and you'll see that in your soil. However, if we break it down and we make it into a finer powder, we're making tons of little bitty bitty pieces with way more surface area per piece and the soil can break it down and the plants can absorb the nutrients much sooner. So that's what we're doing. We're just making a powder kids. And in terms of how I save eggshells throughout the year, <laughs> uh, I just keep the egg carton and I just stick the eggshells in there and let them dry. Um, salmonella is not an issue if you let your eggshells dry thoroughly. So that's what I do. I just put the empty eggshells back in the carton and here we go.
out of 26 dozen egg cartons we went through and it took us one hour to do that. So um, that's a pretty good day. That's a pretty good chore. Uh, now it's done and it's ready. Uh, you can at this point save this until spring when you're starting to put together your mixes and your potting soils and what have you. You can just choose to dump this right into your compost bin now and it'll start the decomp process. Uh, if you're a vermicomposter, you can also sprinkle some of this on your worm bed because they like a little bit of that grit to kind of wiggle and move around in. So um, three great uses. Anyway, hope this is helpful. Hope you find it easy. I love you guys, and I'm going to talk to you on the next one, okay? Bye.